Giuseppe de Ribera, also known as José de Ribera or Los Spagnoletto, was a renowned Spanish Baroque painter and printmaker. He is considered one of the major artists of Spanish Baroque painting, alongside Francisco de Zerberan, Bartolomé Esteban Murillo, and Diego Velázquez. Ribera's talent and contributions to Neapolitan painting have solidified his reputation as one of the outstanding European masters of the 17th century. Ribera's artistic repertoire encompassed history paintings, including biblical subjects and scenes from Greek mythology. However, he is most famous for his vivid depictions of martyrdom, often portraying saints and satyrs bound and suffering in agonizing ways. In addition to these intense works, Ribera also demonstrated his proficiency in portraits, still lives, and landscapes. Notably, he created numerous half-length portraits of workers and beggars, presenting them as philosophers, saints, apostles, and allegorical figures. Ribera's early paintings are characterized by stark realism, utilizing a chiaroscuro or tenebrous style. As his career progressed, he incorporated more color, softer light, and complex compositions, while still maintaining his Caravaggisti influences. Despite the gaps in our knowledge regarding Ribera's early and later life, we do know that he was baptized on February 17, 1591, in Jativa, Spain. He first appears in historical records in 1611, when he was commissioned to paint a church in Parma, Italy. By October 1613, he had become a member of the Accademia di San Luca in Rome and was residing in the Via Marguta, known as the Foreigner's Quarter. Ribera's reputation as an exceptional painter quickly grew in Rome, despite anecdotes suggesting he was both lazy and extravagant. Joseph Marie Veen, early life and influences Joseph Marie Veen, a renowned French painter, was born in Montpellier in 1716. He showed an early talent for art and was supported by Comte de Calus, who recognized his potential. Veen began his artistic journey at a young age in the studio of Nato Ayer, a prominent French painter. Under Nutwar's guidance, Veen honed his skills and developed his own unique style. In 1745, he won the Grand Prix, a prestigious award that propelled his career forward. Veen's time in Rome was transformative, as he immersed himself in the study of nature and drew inspiration from the great works of art that surrounded him. His experiences in Rome greatly influenced his artistic development. Joseph Marie Veen, career and challenges upon returning to Paris, Veen faced challenges due to his unconventional style, which differed greatly from the popular artistic trends of the time. Despite this, he was eventually admitted to the Academy, thanks to the support of François Boucher. Boucher's anger over Veen's painting, Deadless and Icarus, played a crucial role in Veen's acceptance. However, Veen's career reached its peak when he became the director of the School of France in Rome. Interestingly, he refused to mentor Jacques-Louis David, believing him to be too old to benefit from his guidance. Unfortunately, the French Revolution disrupted Veen's life and career, leaving him in ruins upon his return to France. Joseph Marie Veen, Later years and legacy despite the challenges posed by the revolution, Veen continued to create art in his later years. In fact, he even won a government competition at the age of 80 in 1796, showcasing his enduring talent. Napoleon Bonaparte recognized Veen's artistic abilities and appointed him as a senator. Veen passed away in Paris and was buried in the crypt of the Pantheon, a testament to his significant contribution to the art world. As an artist and teacher, Veen influenced many talented individuals, including François-André Vincent, Jean-Antoine Theodore Girist, and Jean-Baptiste Regnault, among others. His son, Marie-Joseph, also followed in his footsteps and became a distinguished painter. In conclusion, Giuseppe de Ribera, also known as José de Ribera or Lo Spagnoletto, was a remarkable Spanish Baroque painter who made a lasting impact on European art. His mastery of various genres, from history paintings to portraits and landscapes, showcased his versatility and creativity. Ribera's vivid and intense depictions of martyrdom, as well as his skillful use of chiaroscuro, set him apart as a unique and influential artist. Despite the gaps in our knowledge about his life, 
Ribera's baptism in 1591 marked the beginning of a career that would establish him as one of the prominent figures of Spanish Baroque painting. His contributions to Neapolitan painting and his ability to adapt his style over time solidify his reputation as a major artist of the 17th century.